Well, hello, everybody. Welcome back to another wonderful day of Charlotte Wars Adventure in Star Maid. Woo! Okay, so what's going on? Well, we're going to continue building this project because, yeah, that's what we're going to do. So, you know what we're up to. We're just going to continue on. Kind of was thinking about the thrusters the other day. I don't know if I want them to be like this, but they might have to be. But I want to install more power into the ship here and then we'll kind of worry about the systems and where to place them and stuff so yeah so let's hop into the ship core here oh the ship didn't rotate that's exciting oh now it did oh it's so annoying because it's always in flight mode right so anyways with that let us continue so we need to use our cargo Oh man, this is brutal. Okay, no, stop, 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 stop. Sheesh, now we're probably upside down compared to everything. Ah, that's so annoying. Okay, <laughs> let's continue building. So, what we're going to do is we're going to basically kind of carry on inside the engines here. And I'm kind of going up to this height and I think we need to turn on the <laughs> plane of symmetry. Because <laughs> that will definitely improve our... I think it's no that's not it i always have to click these because i don't know which one i need okay there we go so basically power power generation that is king that's what i learned with the other spaceship so i'm going to try and maximize the power generation the design of this might change as i go along because i kind of have it on paper the design but through actual once you actually build it then you know you get a different story right so I think we're gonna do this now I want this to run underneath I'm thinking that's kinda what I'm thinking but I don't know where exactly underneath if I just go straight out like this no, actually I need to be like this so if I go straight out like this can I just keep it going maybe ah, maybe that'd be good enough okay let's do that now what's the 182,000? Okay, we need to get this as high as possible because we need to make sure our systems recharge quickly. I hate when systems take a long time to recharge. That gets annoying. As well, the shape of this is going to change because the a part of this is going to go actually down a bit and then straight forward, and then there'll be an observation deck, and then the the salvager and the ray and all that, the missiles are going to be kind of directly in the middle of the ship. That's kind of like the plan, I think. So this actually has to go down a bit. So it's actually two, three, four, one, two, three, four. And then it'll go down. And then there'll be an observation deck down here, which would be the front of the ship. But I'm still kind of deciding if it should be more, kind of more lengthy, like over here versus over here that's kind of I'm kind of tossed up or tossing that in my head but I think what we'll do is we'll carry on I'll build kind of like the outer door the docking door and then maybe I'll build the shell and then we'll kind of see how to fill that all in with the systems but I think power generation is definitely the first thing to sort out here I think we also should do lengthwise this way to add to the power generation perfect so, 215,000. I hope that's enough, because if not, we are totally screwed with that. Yes. Okay. So now, now I want to do that thing where it goes down a bit. Because, see, right now there's a direct line to the core, and I kind of want to change that. I want to protect it a little bit better, which means that the front and back will have to go down a bit which kind of makes sense because I want this ship to be able to land on planets and stuff so that means that back here these will go down to the ground as well and then they'll be docking so I kind of want to put doors on the front and the back of this as well so yeah okay so that's exciting so I tell you what I'm gonna cut to some footage and you're gonna watch me kind of mess around I'm not sure what direction it's gonna go this video is gonna go but I think I'm gonna kind of work on the shell so you're going to see me use, I think, these blocks. I'm going to probably run out of a lot of these blocks. Is this advanced armor? I'm going to use this advanced armor because I have a lot of it. But that material might change. So yeah, so we'll go from there.
Okay, so we've been building onto our spaceship and so here we have kind of like a chamber that I'm going to have and then back here we'll have stairs going up to another level here to an observatory that kind of works up above there. So I'm going to do that. And down here we kind of have our core room, right, which we're going to finish off and close up. Down back here we have all our battery rechargers and everything like that. Well, battery rechargers, our shield rechargers and fun stuff like that, right? We'll turn the, the flashlight on. Let's actually hop into our spaceship here. So here we go. So in between I've placed, I've layered you know, these things. I've layered some shield rechargers and all that fun stuff. I've also put these these uh, sh was it power capacitors so would uh, so that way there's some power stored I also created the back part of the the engines here and I think they look quite nice I like the design I made in the back of them and as well we can't quite s uh, see it but I kind of did some funky things here with the the thrusters to kind of give them a neat little little look to them I think they turned uh, they turned out quite nicely. A little bit sharp corners on some things, but I think that's okay. And here we got these. They're all very nice. I think they're very nice. They look nice. They're they're sharp. I love it. I love the back of my ship here. So now, basically, I'm going to carry on building it, it forward this way, and then we're going to get to kind of the other aspects of the ship, which is the the main part of the ship here. Here we need to create a docking system on one of the side of these or maybe the other side of these. I might move that actually up this way instead. It makes more sense to have it here versus over here. So I might actually change that. But yeah, but here's our ship. It's coming along. It's coming along. You know, it does have the shields now in there, which is good. And, and then down here, we're probably going to put a warp drive here all along the middle maybe or... I'm not too sure, but yeah, but thank you everybody for watching this episode. Hopefully you've enjoyed the building session, and I will continue in the next one with our building. Bye-bye.